Hello my peaches and cream! I'm glad you decided to click on my video to see me trying to frantically keep doing this and not fall into a total chaos. I hope you will enjoy your stay or, if my voice sounds like a baby, going through a wood chipper to you. I understand if you leave. For the rest of you, I got some good stuff planned out. As the title suggests, today we are going through some Choosing Becker Art Edition posts. No, I'm not a Reddit reading channel, even though the idea was partially thanks to me watching so much Reddit content. And these posts that I got are mostly my own, few from nice friends who shared some of their Choosing Art Becker experiences. I'm an artist who has had open commissions, and even though I'm not that popular, it still seems that there always will be choosing beggars trying to wine some free stuff out of ya. I have censored the post, so there won't be a chance for anyone to harass these people. This is all for light-hearted laughs. Let's get to the posts. Hey, I saw your drawings. Can you make me some too? Hi. Yes, I'm doing commissions at the moment, so if you want one, I can put you on the customers list with the others. Okay, how long it takes? Depends on what you want. Also, since there are other customers work before you, it might take longer than a few days. I want you to draw my Ose name censored with a pack of dogs in a forest playing together. Can I get it by tomorrow? I need it. That does sound like a big work to do. I'm not sure if I can do it by tomorrow. Assuming that you want it all colored and detailed. If you pay a small extra fee, I can put you on the front of the customer list, so your work would get my attention first. But I still can't promise I can make it by tomorrow. Yes, full details please. Wait, why the extra fee? Why can't you just do it? Because I'll be prioritizing your work over everyone else's. And don't worry, the extra fee is in the large amount. But I got like 15 I can spend on this. Um, hello? Listen, if you really have only $15, then I'm sorry to say, but that's not gonna be enough. You're asking a work with multiple characters, background and details. It will be way more than just $15, so either ask something smaller or find an artist who has rates more suitable for your budget. Don't be greedy! That should be more than enough! Come on, do it for me! I'll tell my friends about how cool you were because you did art for me for cheap! Why aren't you answering me? Hey, answer me! Are you gonna draw the picture for me? What a freaking ripoff! Freak you! I'm not sure was the person here a young kid or what, but they were demanding quite a lot. Not probably even realizing that art actually takes time. <sighs> then saying that they got like $15 to spend. Just don't understand it, since usually artists who do commissions have their rates up somewhere where you can right away see how much everything is. I don't know. Maybe I was just being an a-hole here, since I stopped answering after they decided to turn rude. You can draw me. I pay you five for it. I got my com ratios up on my page, and basic buzz is 15. Correction, bust. No, five dollars is enough. I know a lot of people who can draw better than you, and they don't ask as much. Well, good for them! But I got my own rates. If you don't like it, go commission someone else. That C word. A friend who sent these screenshots of her interaction with this choosing beggar said that these types of messages or and people are semi-common, which is kind of sad. You can see that she is not taking any BS. And it's always funny how the choosing beggars use the excuse, well, I can get this ch certain thing from other place cheaper. Well, good for you! Then go get it cheaper, you stingy grease stain. Ugh. Hey, you do commissions or not safe for work stuff? Hello, yes, I do commissions and not safe for work stuff, depending on what you want, of course. Cool, I want you to draw me this censored, legs censored, table asking a lot of naughty stuff. I also want them to more weird naughty stuff and okay, wow, freaky, and leather, oh boy. Don't forget to add bad naughty stuff. Want her to be wow, that is a lot of fetish stuff, wow. Hey, I checked your profile and it states that you're 14 years old. I don't think I'm comfortable drawing anything not safe for work related to someone so young. 
especially when I'm over 18 years old. If you want something safe for work, that I can do, otherwise I suggest you ask someone else. Oh come on, why not? I don't wanna ask anyone else. I saw you do stuff for real cheap, so I wanted you to draw it. The stuff I have done has been cheap because they were past character sketches. This sort of detailed not safe for work stuff would have been way more expensive than that. What do you mean more expensive? Isn't that just a ripoff? I'm gonna report you! I'm sorry you feel this way. A freak you, C word. Yeah, this one was a wild ride for sure. I'm not against drawing not safe for work art by any means, but the stuff this person was asking was way too much. And since it seemed that they actually were 14 years old, I didn't want to get myself mixed into that. I know, you can't always know if the person who commissions not safe for work stuff from you is of age, but in this instance I didn't feel comfortable about it. There probably are some people who also think that I'm foolish for not drawing for them, even if they were 14 since I would have been paid, but uh, from the dawn it seemed that they didn't want to pay me probably anyway. You can share your own thoughts on this comment down below. Hey, I saw you were doing commissions here. My two OCs, who I want to be drawn fully colored. Hello, yes, my commissions are open, and this seems doable. So you want your two OCs fully colored, you want full body bust, poses, expressions, any other details like that? Yes, fully colored, half body, expressions can be whatever, you can surprise me. Oh, can you add my OCs bed in too? I'll send you a picture of him. Yes, I can do that. So. Two characters, half body with pet and fully colored. Uh, with my rates, it comes to about forty dollars. You can pay me with PayPal. Okay, so um, I was thinking, could I possibly get a discount on the price, please? Sorry, but I don't give discounts. My prices are set and, and already are cheaper. What other people usually ask. Please, I was planning on ordering more from you. And the other order would be a present for my friend, so like, group order discount? If you really are going to order more, then fine, I can give you a 5 to 10 dollar discount. Just then? That's not a discount at all. I was thinking you could give me the other work half off. Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. $10 discount for the second order. No more. Take it or leave it. After my last message, they stopped responding, so I assume they decided to leave it. This is normal choosing beggar behavior. Asking for a discount. When getting that discount, they aren't happy at all and demand more. Well, on the bright side, at least they didn't call me a greedy C-word or tell me my art was bad or something. Draw for me. I want you to do OC. Well, good evening to you too! OC sketches start from 15 euros, full color is 25 plus. So, what will it be? Why so expensive? You can draw for free. I show it to my friends and followers, you get more customers. Dude, I checked your page and profile, you got like 20 followers. No freebies, sorry. You're selfish and greedy. Freak you! Yes. <laughs> You are selfish and greedy. Freak you. You stupid. You stupid lesbian. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry everyone, but like... <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, but like... That last part always makes me laugh, especially since I, it caught me off guard the first time I read this. This was sent to, sent to me by one of my old friends, who is far from being a lesbian or a woman. I'm not sure what this person was trying to do. Did they think lesbian is some sort of horrible insult? Uh, well, no matter. This was funny to me. I hope my laughing doesn't hurt anyone's feelings. That is not my goal. But yeah, seems that we have run out of posts for now. Sorry that I didn't have more, but I really wanted to read posts that haven't already been read by all the other Reddit channels. Fresh content! Woo woo! Twitter is really one weird place full of art beggars and selfish people. These type of choosing beggar messages isn't the only stuff I have, I have gotten sent to me on Twitter. My style, ideas, anatomy and giving pronouns to my characters have been insulted and called out. This stuff is among many so I don't feel bad about it. And for any other artist out there who might be listening, 
don't feel bad either. If someone says stuff like this to you, they're just one person with one opinion. Keep doing your thing and listen to only constructive criticism to get better. That's about the advice I can give. Oh boy. I'm just waiting for the day when someone puts me in one of these r slash delusional artist subreddits or some other this be stupid thread. And no, this is not an invitation for you to do so. Please, I'm trying to be wholesome here. Or maybe I'll just make r slash delusional artist video and make every post there about me and my r antics. Who knows? Leave a comment if you want to see me do that. Now, thank you for joining me on this little adventure and I hope you see you again in the future. Have yourself a fantastic and safe day. Bye bye, bitches!